American Architectural Review is a national platform where science and art meet, where the issues facing builders and consumers take center stage, where the spotlight seeks out and shines on the creators and innovators. This editorial series, featured on national television, singles out architectural achievements from tools to technique, from form to function. I'm Morley Safer. New technologies and ideas are changing the way we build. Better designs, better materials, better insulation. This story shows us an example of the latest in construction techniques. The rising cost of energy is one of the biggest concerns for businesses today. Ted King, president of Network Services Plus, says he had been searching for new ways to cut his utility bill. He discovered a roof coating made of ceramic insulation that can be applied like paint and has the thickness of a business card. I decided to use this roof coating to reduce energy costs and extend the life of my roof. It was surprising this coating could reduce the roof temperature as much as it did. In fact, I measured a 67 degree temperature difference in my roof during the hottest part of the day. The ceramic insulating coating is formulated to repel heat and minimize energy consumption. Traditional insulation, such as fiberglass bat insulation, work on a resistance factor to slow the penetration of heat. The downside to those insulations are they tend to retain heat and lose insulating value when moisture is present. This coating reflects energy, does not lose its value when um, moisture is present and does not retain any heat. This technology, its basis is to keep a building from getting hot in the first place, thus saving costs. From the tops of trucks to the roofs of buildings, ceramic insulation coating can be used in various applications. In fact, this type of technology was first designed to shield the U.S. Space Shuttle against 3,000 degrees of re-entry heat. Because the ceramic is composed of four different layers, professionals groups say it can offer more protection against heat. One ceramic is actually non-conductive. A second ceramic repels better than 92% of shortwave radiant heat. And a third ceramic repels better than 99% of longwave radiant heat. There's another ceramic that repels infrared. These ceramics in combination have allowed this coating to achieve an R19 insulation value as tested by independent laboratories or the equivalent of six to eight inches of fiberglass bat insulation with merely a seven dry mill thickness coating. King says he's finding that the coating technology is not only benefiting his company's bottom line but also his employees working conditions. The warehouse portion of my building is not climate controlled. In putting the coating on it reduced the temperature and made it a better environment to work in. There's a big initiative right now um, to reduce our, our reliance on foreign energy. And this coating application reduces energy consumption and the heat island effect that's within our cities, as well as the pollution caused by energy generation and global warming. Business managers aren't willing to spend large amounts of money on utility expenses. Many are learning that by using advances in technology to cover their roofs, they may also cover more of their costs. Uh, the coating provide insulation, corrosion control, toxic material encapsulation, and chemically resistant coatings for many applications. EPA recognizes the environmental benefits of this coating for reducing energy consumption and the resulting pollution from energy generation large warehouses or trucking firms where they recognize the need to improve employee working conditions, lower heat, uh, employee uh, heat stress related illnesses, sick leave costs, workman comp claims, and turnover costs. 
Uh, other coatings, such as our corrosion control coatings, can be applied directly over rust without the need for sandblasting or grinding, and they provide unparalleled protection. These coatings, because of their adhesion and abrasion characteristics, are also used for encapsulating toxic materials, such as lead-based paints, asbestos, and other materials that are toxic to our environment. And other coatings that are extremely resistant the very harsh industrial environments and chemical uh, situations. These coatings reduce maintenance cost and they'll uh, continue to provide protection long after other coatings have given up. With the help of technology, architecture and the various industries which support it are rapidly advancing fields. As improvements and innovations occur, you'll see them here on American Architectural Review. Thanks for joining us. Once again, American Architectural Review extends a special thanks to the companies and organizations that have risen to meet the challenges of today's architectural industry.